Hello, hello everyone, welcome. I just wanted to stop in before June was over, the halfway mark of the year, and give an update on my mythographic of the month club hashtag that I'm doing across YouTube and Instagram and things. So I'm gonna quickly show the pages that I have colored so far this year. Not all of these are color alongs on my channel. I think most of them, four out of the six are probably. Um, just because I happened to break my foot and kind of missed a month or so. There's a couple tutorials up instead of full color alongs for those months. But yeah, I thought it would be fun to show you my completed pages. I'm going to update my playlist on YouTube and make a mythographic color along playlist. And that way you can be able to find all the mythographic of the month club videos in that section. So if you see any in here you like that you may have missed... And we will get started. So these little tabs on the front are just for me. Um, so I know which month went to which book because I wasn't sure if I was going to repeat books. The further I got into the year, I realized not a, people like, not a lot of people like the hidden object books when I did Paradise. So I'm not sure whether I want to stick with the newer books for the last half of the year or if I want to continue on and make each month a different book. So if you have a vote on that, let me know. That helps me and we will get started so this is mythographic wild winter um, I actually colored this one in December very close to January but this was a buddy color but it is one I have done in here that I am proud of um, I am proud of myself for sticking with it and getting at least almost one a month done I actually did miss one month but I did two in January so it evened out to still being six <laughs> Um, this is the one we did on the channel. So this is Prismacolor white gel pen, those super shiny paint markers. And yeah, there are, I believe, four parts up for most of these. This was a super fun one to do and to play with, and I realized I just forgot my bug in the middle there. So, um, But yeah, the white gel pen, I think, was the most time-consuming part. The rest of it was fairly quick and simple. So there is our fox page, and I'm going to quickly mark this one of 23 YouTube, because that helps me later on down the road if I show my like favorite pages and things, I know which ones I did on my channel. Sorry about that, someone was walking their dog. Um, let me stick this back on here. So yes, January for the color along on the channel this one I did as a buddy color this one was with Jamie and I I killed this one so I didn't finish mine <laughs> but Jamie's turned out beautiful she rocked hers but I didn't adore mine and if I don't like it I have a the hardest time finishing it um, I don't love this one either but it was better than that one so the background is the color pastel pencils when I first got them uh, the rest is Prismacolor and of course, good old washi tape. So not a lot of shiny or anything on this one. Some white gel pen around the snowflake. I didn't do the stars in the background. I was going to and then changed my mind. And then these were supposed to be, there was already circles there. So I just filled them over with white acrylic paint to kind of sort of give a snowing effect. Not my favorite, but that's okay because I struggle with frozen fantasies. Um, wild winter is more my thing. So... I'm still going to try to get some done in this book, but I do struggle with this one a little more. So there is my two for January. February. February we tackled Magical Earth. And I did a boat, I believe. This was the winning page. So again, Prismacolors. We have some Dollar Tree gel pens down here in the corner. I tried to use cheap gel pens. Um, just so nobody felt like they had to rush out and buy anything fancy to join in. Um, I do do a lot of these in Prismacolors just because if you don't own Prismacolors, a lot of people already have the conversion charts for their pencils from Prismacolor to their pencils. Um, and it is usually the most requested. So, but Yeah, that was a fun one to do as well. All right, and then I brought in just a nice brown washi tape border to try to pull in some of the brown from his antlers and things, give it a picture frame feel. So yeah, there is our February, and this one came off. These tabs do not stick. 
I've seen so many ladies use them, and I'm like, yes, these tabs are gonna, no. They end up everywhere but where I put them. So this is March. There is not a full color along on this page, but I did get a background tutorial up for it. So the Prismacolors, the good old white gel pen, acrylic paint splatter. This is my favorite page so far for Mythographic, probably in general, for 2023. I am so pleased how this came out. Rainbow aesthetic is my thing. Um, I really enjoy it. It's bright and happy feeling. So there is a background up. I think I am still going to come in and black out this border, if not with washi tape, but maybe acrylic paint. Um, I usually do tape right here because the one book I had fell apart and I was super sad about it. But yeah, my favorite page so far. Alright, so there is that one. And that is the only one. I really want to tackle another one out of here. Um, maybe not on video, but I really like this cosmic one. Um, Voyage was for April, and I did not get one up for this either, as I was not able to sit at my desk for long periods of time. But I did do a tutorial background for a galaxy. Now, I have two versions of a galaxy up, one with the black in it more so. This one is more purpley pink and blue, and that was because I just didn't want a lot of black in this one. Um, I just wanted a nice, bright, happy galaxy feel. So, um, I will include these short little tutorials in the playlist with color alongs, just in case you are looking for them. Um, but if you need help finding them, you can always reach out. I can do that as well. There is April. So April didn't have a completed. And then we started back with Paradise in May. And this one is an older book. So it did have the, that is not the page, the um, hidden objects that not everybody loved. So that's where I need to know, do you enjoy these older books? Should I continue in these older books or should I stick with the newer ones? Do you mind if I repeat books we've already colored in like another one out of Cosmic? Or would you like to keep each month a different book? Um, so here's our windmill. This is shimmer watercolor paints that I ordered off of Timu. I was really happy with those that came out. Um, but yeah, I like my page overall. Again, I didn't know if these in the back were supposed to be clouds. So I made mine bushes. <laughs> um, I haven't washi taped this yet. Just because I want to find a blue that matches this. And I haven't got that far yet. It is on my list of things to do. But yes, this is my completed for May. So there is our May color along. And this one I think has the most completed pages for me so far just because it's my favorite until Cosmic came out. And then here we are in June. So this is Mythographic Menagerie. And I'm sure if you've been following, you're tired of seeing this one. But... Here is Mythographic Menagerie, and I am so happy with how this one turned out. I was a little worried in the beginning, background-wise, what I envisioned wouldn't translate to paper. And there's a couple spots like right here that probably could be blended a little better, but overall, I'm happy. Um, I think the gold washi tape really brings out the center of that flower and the dots. I think my giraffe stands out without standing out too much. And um, yeah, it came together really well. So this is the most recent one. So there is a four part color along up, probably not on the playlist yet, but up if you are interested. Yeah. So my next question is, I have these two pulled for July. Would we like to tackle the lion and the water with the space background out of dream gardens? And again, this one has the hidden objects because I've pretty much worked through the books I have that don't have hidden objects. So we've got a scooter and a xylophone and a spring down here. Or do we want to jump into deep blue? I know some people may not have their books yet because it's fairly new out. But do we want to jump into deep blue and do the saloon page? This is my favorite page out of the whole book. Um, if you have another suggestion out of deep blue, you can definitely let me know and I put a vote up or something but this is the one I have my eye on anyways I will probably color this one regardless but your input just helps me 
so um, deep blue or dream garden questions comments anything like that please let me know thanks for watching my quick little update on hashtag mythographic of the month club again if you want to join in you don't have to do the same book as me any page any book just use the hashtag thanks for watching i hope to see you for july's bye